Welcome back everyone. It is 817 on our Friday morning. It's also National Rescue Dog Day and there's a yappy hour tonight. You won't want to miss. We have some dogs up for adoption joining us here in the studio, uh, but more importantly, of course, many dogs looking for their forever homes as well. So this morning we have Julie, Lauren, Michelle. We also have it was Brad, right? Ben. ben. Yeah. Oh, here we go. Ben and Grace, right? Okay, so we also have several animals with us all from the animal pad telling us about yappy hour tonight. Uh, okay, a lot of dogs. A lot of excitement this morning. They all look so cute. Yeah. Uh, but I want to start off with the event happening tonight. So you want to take it away with what's going on? Sure. Cool. Yes, we are the Animal Pet Dog Rescue. We are a nonprofit all breed dog rescue here in San Diego. We primarily rescue from the streets of Mexico, but also high kill shelters here in Southern California. And it is National Rescue Dog Day, and we are celebrating at the Coastal Cantina downtown San Diego from 4 to 7 p.m. We have a special yappy hour going on. A portion of the proceeds will be donated back to the animal pad. We're going to have the cutest adoptable dogs ever at the event. A couple local vendors selling like thoughtful <laughs> treats, spread positivity, Kiki's Pop Teak. They are modeling these cute, adorable yeah. necklaces right now. We wanted to make sure I know, they they're super so cute. cute. So the, these are for sale, these uh, yeah, necklaces? Yeah, Kiki's Pop Teak. It's an 11-year-old awesome. girl who okay. makes them and donates back to rescue. Oh, and cool. these cuties will be there. This is Typo and Pixel. Typo and Pixel. And Ben, who do you have? This is Olive. Olive, are you Olive's father? Foster parent right now? We, the two of us. The two, okay, yeah, perfect. And, I, yeah. and so will Olive be up for adoption tonight? She's been up for adoption. She's been up, okay, exactly. <laughs> and how about these two? These two will be there tonight. Okay, perfect. So, I mean, along with, of course, just being able to spend some time with the animals out there, you also want to get these dogs their homes. I'm sure you love being foster parents, but <laughs> the goal is, of course, to find someone who can take these animals on, on for their lives, right? Absolutely. So, yeah. what's it been like? I mean, I, it, I'm assuming these animals, as we can see here, are very well behaved, uh, but what's, what's the goal, of course, with the, the homes you're looking for for these animals? Yeah, so the homes we're looking for, um, basically, we don't discriminate on homes around San Diego. Um, most of our dogs come from the streets, uh, so what you can provide them is so much better than what they came <laughs> from. Um, we do have an adoption process on our website uh, at theanimalpad.org slash adoption. You can see all of the profiles for our adoptable dogs and you can apply there. Um, our team is all volunteers, but uh, our process is pretty quick. So if you are interested in adopting, you can check out our event tonight or check out our website. Site. What's it like being a foster parent? Do you like it? I love it. It is so rewarding. It's amazing. Um, we have fostered probably about 10 dogs for the animal pack. Wow. And I think our sixth <laughs> or seventh one we just loved so much we had to keep. Um, <laughs> So we kept her. I did the same thing with a cat that I, I was a foster fail, as they say. Yeah, it happens. It happens a lot. Right? Yeah, it's very rewarding to see them come from the streets and get healthy and be able to be adopted. So how long have you guys been with the animal pad? I'm going to start off with Julie. What's the, uh, why do you do it, basically? Uh, well, I'm obsessed with dogs. <laughs> <laughs> a good start, right? That's a good start. Um, and it's just such a rewarding uh, feeling to know where they came from. Some of these dogs were on the brink of death, and to see that transformation of where they came from yeah. and, and where they are now, it's just makes my heart feel good. So how many dogs do you guys have in total that are up for adoption, up for fostering? What's it like at your we facility? Have a lot. You have a lot? <laughs> we have a lot, yeah. So most of our dogs are in foster homes. Uh, we have probably 200 dogs in wow. foster right now in San Diego County. So a lot of dogs uh, available. Uh, on our website, I think we have around 100 dogs right now, okay. which is the most it's ever been. Um, adoptions have definitely slowed down given that you know people are going back to work right. and uh, life circumstances. So uh, we are just out here here, we're not slowing down, so right. we're out here just rescuing the way we normally do, the only way we know how. Uh, so we definitely are looking for adopters and fosters who can help us continue going, you know, with the trend right. and, and just to allow us to not have to say no to dogs that need us. getting a little weirded out by the camera there. It's a flavor. Weirded out by the tutus. Yeah, exactly, right? The tutus cute. I like it. She looks it. good. Um, so, I mean, can people go online literally and look through, like, pictures of the dogs, yeah. scroll through? Okay, so it's really easy to do on your guys' mm -hmm. website. We have a full profile. We have a bio writing team that's awesome that basically writes, like, a dating profile yeah, for the dog. Yeah, fun. As you can go and match. Yeah, it's really, it's very Perfect. cute. So, uh, before we go, remind people about the event tonight, what's going to be happening, and, and where they can go. You want to do it, Julie? Oh, yeah, sure. <laughs> <laughs> Um, so, National Rescue Dog Day, we are celebrating at the Coastal Cantina, downtown San Diego, 4 to 7 p.m. We're going to have lots of adoptable dogs. You don't want to miss it. 
I love it. And name these three again. Who do we have? Who's this, this one? This is Ty oh, Pixel's Ty over here. Pixel, this cutie, <laughs> this typo. typo and Olive, all looking for their homes and many, many more on your guys' website. So thank you for joining us. What's the website, by the way? Theanimalpad.org. Animalpad.org. No kill, rescuing all these animals. Yep. I mean, it's really important. So thank you guys so much for coming in. We're taking a quick break, or I think, yeah, we're taking a quick break. We'll be back after this. <laughs>